Mount Oakmok is the highest point on the rim of Oakmok caldera on the northeastern part of Umnak Island in the eastern Aleutian Islands of Alaska. This 5.8-mile-wide circular caldera truncates the top of a large shield volcano. A crater lake once filled much of the caldera, but the lake ultimately drained through a notch eroded in the northeast rim. The prehistoric lake attained a maximum depth of about 150 meters and the upper surface reached an elevation of about 475 meters, at which point it overtopped the low point of the caldera rim. Small, shallow remnants of the lake remained north of Condi at an altitude of about 1,075 feet. A small, shallow lake located between the caldera rim and Condi, a smaller lake farther north near the caldera Caldera's Gate. After the 2008 eruption, the hydrogeology of the caldera was greatly changed with five separate sizable lakes now in place. In addition to the caldera lakes, Kona, Kone E, Kone G and the new 2008 vent on Kone D contain small crater lakes. The last major eruptions of Oak Mark with a VEI strength of 6 occurred 8,300 and 2,400 years years before present. Following the formation of the caldera, numerous satellite cones and lava domes have formed on the flanks of the volcano. They include Mount Tulik, Mount Idak, and Jag Peak. Mount Tulik erupted in 1936. The volcano is currently rated by the Alaska Volcano Observatory as Aviation Alert Level Green and Volcanic Alert Level Normal. July 2008 Eruption On Saturday, July 12, 2008, Oakmar Caldera exploded without warning, sending a plume of ash to 50,000 feet into the air. During the following five and a half days of nearly continuous eruption, residents of Nikolsky were stranded for periods of up to three weeks. Unalaska was repeatedly dusted with ash and flights into and out of this major fishing hub were frequently disrupted. Floating rafts of scoria and high visibility prompted the Coast Guard to close Umnak Pass to marine traffic, and the Bering Pacific Cattle Ranch on the flanks of Oak Mock was periodically evacuated, once during noontime darkness caused by heavy ashfall. The eruption ended in August 2008. It had a VEI of 4, giving it a rating of cataclysmic. No lava flow was reported in this eruption, though the volcano has issued flows in the past. The eruption took place at a new vent in the northeast part of the caldera, creating a roughly 800 feet high cone, dramatically altering caldera hydrology, and discharging huge lavas, or volcanic mug flows, running from the caldera to the coast. In contrast, all 20th century eruptions have been from a cone near the southern rim of the caldera. The 2008 eruption was by far the largest eruption at Oakmok since at least the early 13th century. The volcano also erupted in February 2010 and produced lava splash and ash clouds to 9,000 meters.